keep this winning streak going. on their way to the locker room earlier, hoping to send their fans home happy tonight. Happy holidays, everyone. Welcome to our coverage of the NBA on 2K Sports. I'm Brian Anderson. With me tonight, Grant Hill and Richard Jefferson. And as we get into the meat of the season, teams sometimes have those team-building excursions, RJ. Any favorites you ever participated in? Uh, we had a Napa excursion one time. That was a lot of fun. But bowling, seeing a movie, all of those things were fun. And now the opening lineup for Chicago. We've got Buzelis, Kobe White out there with Josh Giddy. Then it's MP, and it's Williams in at the power forward spot. Making sure of that one, MP at ground zero. Here's Young. Chicago with a rebound. It's an understatement to say they're on a roll. They're coming in on a 15-game winning streak. There is a lot of players who will say they don't take notice of a budding winning streak. But when it's double digits, everyone knows. Winning streaks are a lot harder than people think because every single team wants to be the one to take you down. A Kong Wu. Oh, the dunk by a Kong Wu. And despite the height disadvantage, oh my, he just attacks that interior. Really unfazed. Throw his height right out the window there. MP with it. And Johnson picks him up defensively. Pass to Williams. MP is doubled. Uses the glass to finish the layup. MP's got six points. Executing the plan here early. Still haven't missed the shot. Outside Johnson. Outside Bogdanovich. That three's off the mark. The Bulls have gone three of three so far from the floor. Williams from long range drops in the three. Wow, now this is how you want to start your games. Flawless shooting so far. Young against White. MP with the block. Teams are realizing you have to account for MP on that defensive end, especially when you're going up near the hoop. And they double up MP, and Jalen Johnson is going to pick up the foul. That's his first foul of the game. And the first quarter of action, two minutes in. White, the pass to MP. MP is doubled. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. Give him eight points now. And why go away from attacking inside if the D has no answer for you? And six man, a common term in basketball, has a unique meaning for the Atlanta Hawks grant. Yeah, it's the name of their fan base. Extremely loyal and passionate. And they've swayed the outcome of games. He gives up a bit of size at the center position, but his leaping ability, well, let's just say that makes up for it. Outside, Williams. And they double up MP. Goes back up. And there's two. Work on the glass, paying off that time. Boy, absolutely no rim protection, leading to a lot of easy buckets here. Outside Bogdanovich. First quarter of play, and we're about three minutes in. 
Johnson with a bucket. Really good passing wing. Risa Shea isn't a ball stopper. He really looks for his teammates. Chicago leading by six. Down low. And they double up MT. It's rebounded by Risa Shea. He's as surprised as we are. Most nights, that bucket is automatic. Pass to Young. This one for three. Kept alive by Atlanta. Second shot opportunity. It's hauled in by White. His consistency just hasn't been there this quarter in terms of his shooting. Now here's MP. Defended by Bogdanovich. And MP gets it to go on the assist by White. MP's got 12 points in the game. And here's Young. He'll bring it up for the Atlanta Hawks. Trailing by eight. Victory eluded them last time in Chicago when they faced the Bulls. They were blown out by this squad last time. Could not stop the bench from scoring. That was the difference. Bogdanovich from long range. Chicago with a rebound. They defeated Milwaukee in their last game. Oh, man, they were in total control. Really doing anything they wanted. <laughs> it was that level of dominance. It really is fun seeing an offensive function like a well-oiled machine. I'll be interested to see if they can keep doing this. All right, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Bulls? Guys, they're bullying them in the post, using their size and strength as an advantage, exploiting the defense. Another thing they're doing well early on is moving the ball, playing selfless basketball, and getting everybody involved on the offensive end. He's been held scoreless tonight, really just unable to make any sort of impact. MP inside, guarded by Okongwu. Tipped! Here's Risa Shea, still without a bucket. Pass to Okongwu. Now here's Johnson. Young inside. He's guarded by White. Clock at four. The Hawks need to get one up here. And here's a Kong Wu for three. That's in. Coming off an assist from Young. Young's got three assists in the game. Chicago leading by eight. Outside White. MP inside. A Kong Wu on him. And White hits from deep. Building a big advantage early with a terrific all-around performance. They got off to such a hot start, and that can keep you energized throughout the whole game. Get there, get there. White against Young. Pass to Riza Shea. Over Buzelis. Riza Shea, no good. Chicago has gone two of two at the perimeter. Giddy passes to MP. throws it down. When MP is having a night like this, you just can't keep him from getting the ball. Now Young, coming off a 34-point game against Minnesota. In total command of the offense, the passing was insane, especially when you consider how many points he put up. He's consistent from out there, especially when you give him that kind of room. And so here is Chicago. 10-point lead. Back to White. To the paint. Here's MP. Another shot. The rebound by Atlanta. They come into this one following the loss to Minnesota. And they got to the line at a good clip, but couldn't cash in, and it ruined their chances. Leaving point at the free throw line can take the edge off of a team. You're playing physical, you're playing hard, and it's just not paying off. Five on the clock. Young from long range. And it's MP with a rebound. MP's got seven rebounds in the game. White drives in. Pass to Buzelis. Inside. Here's MP. The shot's good on the assist by Giddy. MP's got 16 points now. But he's been locked all the way in from the floor, and he's the number one reason why they're winning right now. It's tipped. Stolen by Giddy. Lays it up and banks it in. And the Bulls lead by 14. You can't help but look toward their defense. <laughs> They're totally lost. Screen by Young. The three from Rizache. 
And it's MP with a rebound. Defensively, you pick your poison. That time, they gambled off the right guy. And that's his second foul committed with a lot of game left. Gotta be careful. To the middle. Cash money. Out of his 14 attempts, he's drained nine of them. They've shown so much energy right from the start, particularly on the offensive end. They came out swinging, really setting the tone on offense, and the opposition has not been able to respond. Yeah, at the offensive end, more often than not, you'll find Capella at the rim. And MP with a basket on the assist by Ball. MP's got 20. And what's working here? Each guy is willing to make the next pass. Here's Daniels. Over to the wing. Pass to Johnson. Fires from deep. Chicago with a rebound. No question who's in control of the board so far. RJ, when you talk about Vucevic, is he the best NBA player ever to come from Switzerland? There is an argument to be made. He has the most points by any Swiss-born player by far and the only All-Star game appearances. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Here's Johnson. And it's Chicago with a board. MP's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Capella with a rebound. Hawks trail by 18. Hunter with the ball, guarded by Vucevic. Outside Hunter. Six on the shot clock. He was all alone on that one. Johnson's gotten his third basket of the night. And we talk about the importance of versatility. He's really got it all on the offensive end. Outside Giddy. Back to MP. The kick out to Ball. MP is doubled. Outside Giddy. Ball outside. 4-3. Here's White. No good. Would have counted had it gone. Domination in the first quarter. It's been pretty lopsided. Chicago ahead, up by 15. Let's take a quick break, and then it's on to the second quarter after this. here. Akangwu comes in for Capella, and Bogdanovich is subbed in for Daniels. Chicago making a switch here. And almost four minutes gone in the second quarter of play. Pass to Young. Back to Nance. To the inside. And the layup is good after a nice lead pass. Bogdanovich has got his first points of the night. Chicago leading by 11. And so in the game for the Bulls, Patrick Williams out there with Buzelis. Then it's Ball. Then it's Kobe White. And it's MP in at the 5. Bogdanovich against White. Bogdanovich no good. And their physical dominance has been on display. A 10 rebound advantage is a good indicator of how this game has gone. MP is doubled. Muscling it home, MP. That is a play that is beyond his years. MP takes the contact and still gets it to fall. And let's send it over to Allie LaForce. Well, MP in the last matchup against the Bucks was a man on a mission. He had an unbelievable amount of points and managed to snag 20 rebounds. A tremendous night for him. A legendary performance that will be talked about for years to come. Unless he's able to do it again tonight, Brian. Okay, Allie, thanks. Well, that was an incredible night for him. They rode him to that win. And he was more than happy to carry them, B.A. He might still be feeding off that performance heading into this one. And it's very likely that he and his guys can carry that momentum into this one. Rock the baby. Working the size advantage inside. 
And so it's Young with it. He brings it up for Atlanta. It's a 13-point game. Nance outside. Pass to Hunter. Oh, they get a hand on it. Ball with a steal. Inside. Here's Williams. And Williams punches it home. Such a good facilitator. Ball has nice touch on that pass. Atlanta has gone just one of six from the perimeter here in the second. Here's Bogdanovich. Let's it go from deep. Connects from downtown. Bogdanovich has got his second basket on the night. And this is why Bogdanovich is a vital cog in this offense. It's his ability to stretch the floor like that. Man, that's now 10 straight points in the paint. I'm not sure what's happened to their defense, man. Well, the last time the Bulls won a playoff series was back in 2015, Grant. That was back when Butler and Rose were their leading scorers. And it just shows you just how long it's been. But they've been stuck in mediocrity ever since. And right now, they are desperate for a breakthrough season. Dance against Williams. The three is up. Good. And the assist goes to MP. MP's got four assists now tonight. And MP's teammates appreciate this. He understands how valuable passing is to team chemistry, and he learned it quickly. And so it's Quinn Snyder here calling timeout. A moment to rest and confer on the game plan. Atlanta making some changes. Johnson, he's checked in for Nance. Risa Shea comes in for Hunter, and Daniels is subbed in for Young. Giddy's checked in for Chicago. Here's Risa Shea. Still no points. Pass to Bogdanovich. Knocks down the long J. After failing to get going in the first quarter, he's looked much better here in the second. Chicago leading by 14. Down low. Here's Buzelis. Here's MP. Guarded by Okongwu. Outside White. Launches it. And again, it's Chicago with a three. And the Hawks with possession here. Here's Daniels. The three from Rizache. Chicago with a rebound. MP's got 12 rebounds here tonight. Big time effort. And they're up considerably because of their efforts on the glass. Akongwu with the rebound. Hawks trail by 17. Here's Riza Shea. A reliable offensive contributor. Putting up almost 14 a game. From deep, Johnson. And it's Giddy with a rebound. Chicago has gone three of four from outside so far in the second quarter. Here's MP. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. MP's got eight here in this quarter. They're in strong position coming down the stretch, and he is a big reason why. 156 left to play in the second quarter. Oh, the dunk by a Kongwu. Get him the ball anywhere close to the hoop. That thing is over. Hunters checked in for Daniels. And you played for several different coaches with very different philosophies, Grant. Did you have a favorite system? Well, you know, B.A., I did. I played 19 years, a number of different coaches. But the eight seconds or less offense back when I was with the Suns as a player, you want to run. And honestly, it's so much fun getting up and down a court like that. And for Atlanta, they're shooting around 41%. Here's Risa Shea. No made baskets yet. Pass to Bogdanovich. Clock at six. And that's his fourth bucket of the game in seven attempts. It's obvious he's taking it upon himself to try and keep them alive. To the middle. Who poked away. It's stolen by Hunter. Over Williams. Hunter can't get it to go. Chicago leading by 18. To the paint. Here's MP. The shot's good on the assist by Giddy. MP's got 32 points. 
Yeah, MP capitalizing on being so close to the hoop. Outside Johnson. Here's Bogdanovich. No good on the shot. Oh, great D that time from MP. Rebound Atlanta. Four seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Bogdanovich up top. He's guarded by White. The kick out to Johnson. The three is up. And they'll get another chance. Riza Shea, no good. MP outside with one on the clock. Oh, and he hits it at the buzzer. Great job ending the quarter on a high note. That's the play that pumps up the whole team, and they'll try to carry that energy into the next period. And through one half, it hasn't even been close. Chicago ahead, opening up a huge gap. And we'll be right back after halftime for the start of the third quarter. See you in just a bit. Welcome, everybody. We'll get things going with a look at who might be participating in the upcoming three-point contest. Some really interesting names here. So many great shooters in the league. That said, I know who I would pick. Shaq? Shaq Shadama says you've picked the wrong guy, Kenny. And let's talk now about the game we've been watching. What a terrific first half for the Chicago Bulls. Well, they're playing bully ball inside, so much so that, Shaq, I'm going to let you take it. Oh, uh, yeah. One, two. One, two, one, two, in the place to be, most definitely. They seize the paint like a MIC. Me and Ernie and Kenny. Thanks for joining us. Time to head back over to the third quarter with Brian Anderson. After a very lopsided first half, we'll see if things play out a little more evenly in the second. Hey, you look at MP in this game. He's been everywhere. And given that he's just delivered a double-double through two quarters, I'm excited to see his stats at the end of the night. But I don't think that that's the most important thing to him. Sure, putting up big numbers doesn't hurt, but he's all about getting the win over everything else. Bogdanovich and Riza Shea, the wingmen. Johnson at the four with a Kongwu at the five. And it's Young in at the point guard position. That's the five to begin the second half for Quinn Snyder. Defensively, they've got to get more bodies in the paint. That's three straight field goals from below the free throw line. And here's Bogdanovich. A Kongwu, a screen on Giddy. Bogdanovich from long range. Williams grabs the board. Yeah, and the defense really respects his shooting ability, and they showed it with that tight coverage. That's tipped, and it's going to be out of bounds. The Bulls will retain possession. And the latest power rankings. We're still in December, but we are starting to see things take shape in the NBA. You look at the Warriors. They're building some momentum right now and aiming for a spot in the top five. Well, right now for the Bulls, they continue to look incredibly dangerous. The cohesion and teamwork they show on a nightly basis has a lot to do with that. And Young has got the ball here for Atlanta. Well, Grant, aside from making the East Finals in 2021, how would you assess Trey Young's teams? Well, they're always solid offensive teams, but Trey is the type of player that you need to surround with defensive-minded guys, and he hasn't really had that. MP, rebound Atlanta. Outside Young, to the middle. Here's Johnson. Oh, and Johnson slams it in. The B.A., when he gets the rim in his sights, it's tough to stop. So aggressive and a determined finisher. Nice. White, the pass to MP. Outside, Williams. Down low. The kick out to White. Four on the clock. 
Oh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. Well, Richard, during his fifth year in the NBA, Kobe White had a breakout season. Doubling his numbers, B.A., averaging around 20 points and five assists per game. Kobe's always been a great defensive player, but it's his offensive production that has really improved. Grant, how about Kobe White going from a bench player to one of the league leaders in minutes? Yeah, Kobe played more than 35 minutes per game last season. Top 10 in the league. We saw White hit another level, so he has an exciting future in front of him. Gives us a chance to catch up with Allie LaForce. Hey, Brian. Jalen Johnson is developing the complete game. He said, I watch the guys who do everything. That's my mindset. I want to be at least solid in every department and then keep building on that, adding bits and pieces here and there. Brian, his versatility is already drawing attention league-wide. Yeah, there's no question about that, Allie. Thank you. A little over two and a half minutes off the clock in this final half of play. Young misses. They are losing because he is struggling so bad, and he has not looked comfortable all game. That one goes in. White's got 16 points. Well, you see, the ability to get the ball where it needs to go is what really stands out regarding Buzelis. Young, the pass to Johnson. Here's Reza Shea. Atlanta again missing. MP against the Kongwu. Outside Giddy. Back to MP. Come to me, come to me. Akongwu with the rebound. Akongwu's got rebound number five here tonight. Outside Young. Pass to Johnson. The kick out to Young. Bogdanovich with it. Misses the three. Inside. Here's MP. Good! That's another bucket. I mean, yet again, he's reached 40 points. He's close to having the fourth most 40-point games in a single year. Well, we've seen it. He's been on fire all season long. Young from long range fires in the triple. Seven points in the game. The deep ball from Young. He only needs a little wiggle room to feel comfortable firing away. Back to Giddy. MP left side. It's rebounded by Reza Shea. The Hawks have gotten just three of eight shots to go in the third quarter. To the wing, right side. Johnson a screen on Giddy. The three from Reza Shea. It's hauled in by the Bulls. MP's got his 20th rebound here tonight. White finds MP. Bogdanovich against Giddy. Back to MP. Pass to Buzelis. Let's go with a three. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Buzelis. All right, now we have a moment. Here are the most efficient teams from range over the past month. Number one, Chicago. Well, a hot streak like this breeds confidence. A virtuous cycle. You see shots going down. You take that next one with extreme confidence. Hunters checked in for Atlanta. And a change for the Bulls. Balls checked in. Outside Young. Pass to Bogdanovich. And he banks in the layup. Bogdanovich has got 12. You like seeing Bogdanovich get it done inside. An opportunistic score around the rim. Knocked away. And that's out of bounds. Chicago will retain possession. And a look at the stats for MP. And during the last five games, he's been a force on the boards, really throwing his body at rebounds and trying to grab as many as he can. And that kind of effort has been noticed by his coaches and teammates. There's Ball with a three. Nails it from three. Love whenever Ball is assertive like this. This is how dangerous he can be on offense. And so it's Bogdanovich with it. He brings it up for the Hawks. 
Over the last few years, Atlanta struggled defensively, Grant. Yeah, the Hawks haven't been better than 20th in defensive rating since 2017. They've had some great offensive teams during that time, but their defense has held them back. Well, I guess we could give them credit for not getting discouraged. They're still playing hard. He's doing his job out there. MP left side. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Nice ball movement there. That's how you break down the defense. Set it up. The Hawks have gone 5 of 11 in this third quarter. Hunter on the wing. The rebound by MP. Chicago has gotten seven of eight three-pointers to go in this game. Ball left side. Here's MP. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket is good, and he'll go to the line. Ooh, he's been the guy tonight. Really impressive performance. All right, well, a look at how the points have been generated so far. A scoring breakdown for the Bulls. Oh, they've been punishing the inside defense consistently in this one. Look, it's been a very productive area of the floor for them. And we've also seen them attack from the post. A lot of key possessions have ended with them scoring on the block. Now, I know he makes it look easy, but it takes incredible physical tools to pull that off. Athleticism and explosion. And that replay courtesy of the AT&T 5G Slam Can. Ball passes to MP. And here is Williams. And it's in there. Williams has got 13. Since half, there's been a stark contrast between these teams. I'm talking about efficiency at the offensive end. And start with their defense. They've been intense on that end, and they can actually help their offense as well. And it's Kitty with a rebound. The Bulls have gone 8 of 12 from the floor in the third quarter. Pass to MP. Uses the glass on the layup. MP's got 47 points. And the defense has no one to blame but themselves. I mean, they just let him get right to the rim. That's a great possession. Put your best players in a position to succeed. Now Capella. Here's Daniels. From outside, off the mark. Chicago shooting at a very efficient 67%. Ball finds MP. One forty-four left in the third quarter. Soft touch off the glass. MP's got 49 in the game. And they've really managed to dominate inside. Pass to Bogdanovich. Three-pointer. Hits the trifecta. He was solid in the first half from deep. He's a guy who can get hot. Let's see how he does here in the second. Now a timeout called by Chicago. Making a change here. Nance has checked in. Chicago's gotten seven of eight three-pointers to go in this game. And out of bounds, Atlanta will have it. There's one for the low light. Wow. I'm not sure who messed up the pass, but look, somebody did. We've got 123 left in the third. Pass to Hunter. And here's Capella, covered by Vucevic. Back to Hunter. Here's Daniels. Just five on the clock. From outside the arc. That shot is off. Daniels has gotten just one of his four attempts from the floor tonight. Here's Craig. The rebound by Atlanta. Now here's Hunter. No points so far. Pass to Daniels. And there's the call on Lonzo Ball. That's his third foul so far. Smith, he's checked in for Chicago. Number seven, Jalen Smith. The Hawks. Well, 
Bogdan Bogdanovich checked in for Johnson. And it's Trey Young in for Daniels. MPs checked in for Chicago. And so in the game for the Bulls, MP is out there with Nikola Vucevic. Then there's Desumu. Then it's Ball. And it's Craig in at the three spot. Bogdanovich from long range. It seems like every miss ends up in his hands. He's been unreal. You aren't exaggerating. You don't get to 20 rebounds without having a special talent for grabbing misses. Young with it. Guarded now by Ball. And here's Hunter for three. That one's good, and it's Young with the assist. This is what it's been since halftime. Remarkable results from downtown. In the modern NBA, you have to hit threes to win games, and they've made that adjustment since the break. Craig with a screen. Here's MP. Another bucket. Wow. I mean, he has been hot as a kettle and serving all comers. And make it a little history tonight. He's just tied for the third most 50-point games in league history. Tying up none other than Kobe Bryant with 25. And when you're being compared with him, you know you're doing something right. Bogdanovich, that's good. You can tell Bogdanovich is in an attacking mindset right now, being aggressive and getting rewarded for it. Ball passes to Vucevic. The Sun move for three. Pass to MP. Nance pulls down the board. Atlanta's gone two of four from the perimeter here in the fourth quarter. Outside Young. There's Bogdanovich with the three. Ball with the rebound. Ball's got his fourth rebound in this one. To the inside. Desumu outside. Parked it down low that time. Got hit with the three-second call. And Grant with the 65 games rule for player awards. It did seem there was a real reduction in load management. Yeah, B.A., and I liked it. The Stars played more early on, but we also saw a lot of them get banged up by the playoffs. So it seems there's still a balance to be struck. Bogdanovich from long range. He's off on that one. He continues to let it fly, but the makes have been few and far between. Desumu outside. And they double up MP. Shot clock at six. And got it! Another basket! Oh, he's been absolutely ridiculous in this game. B.A., it feels like he can't miss. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Here's Young. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. It's going to be on Lonzo Ball. Richard, when it comes to the Bulls, they have one of the most committed fan bases in the league. Yeah, the Chicago fans are for real. The Bulls are routinely at the top of the list for total attendance. Even on the road, they're usually Bulls fans sprinkled in every crowd. Akangwu's checked in for the Hawks. Johnson comes in for Hunter. Here's MP. It's stolen by Akangwu. Bogdanovich with it, guarded by Vucevic. Bogdanovich down low. Akangu, no good. Got the ball where he wanted it, but then got swarmed. Ball passes to Vucevic. Now here's Craig. Back to Vucevic. Inside. Here's MP. And yes, another basket. <laughs> this game has his name written all over it. He has been phenomenal. An offensive onslaught. Outside Bogdanovich. Outside Johnson. And that one goes. He's shooting five of nine in this one. He's good enough where it takes a lot to bother him at the rim like that. The Bulls have gone five of eight from the field so far in the fourth. Here's MP. Yes, sir. And it's Ball with the assist that time. Ball's got ten assists here tonight. So active. And so it's Young with it. He brings it up for the Hawks. Pass to Johnson. 
Outside Bogdanovich. Well, you look at the so-called super teams that have been assembled in recent years. A lot of cautionary tales. Yeah, I mean, teams giving up their draft picks for the better part of a decade to bring in a star. It can get ugly really fast if things don't work out. Reese Shea, he's checked in for Atlanta. And a change for the Bulls. Carter, he's checked in for Ball. Here's Reese Shea. Left side, Young. Outside, Johnson. Pass to Reza Shea. The three. On target from range. Yeah, that's what Reza Shea is out here to do. He is first and foremost a three-point shooter. A good one at that. MP right side. And they double up MP. Banked it in off the glass. MP's got 59 points. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. The Hawks have gone 7 of 14 here in the fourth from the floor. Pass to Reza Shea. Outside Johnson. There's Bogdanovich with the three. Chicago with a rebound. Man, miss after miss for him. When you're having a quarter like this, the only beneficiary is the defense. To the paint. Yet another bucket. Oh, make that 61 points. Everything is going his way right now. Outside Johnson. Fires for three. The rebound by MP. Ooh, that's a tough break. After poor communication defensively, it leaves him all by himself. Well, Grant, in terms of scheduling, you see any way to eliminate back-to-backs? You know, I'm not a big fan of eliminating back-to-backs, but to answer your question, B.A., you have two choices. You either fewer regular season games or extend the season by a few weeks. I don't think either one of those options is in our future. Young against Carter. Johnson for three. That's in. Coming off an assist from Young. Young's got seven assists in the game. Yeah, defensively, if you come off someone, Young will find him. Pass to MP. 156 left in the fourth quarter. He is torching a defense that simply has no answers for him. The Hawks shooting 47% since the fourth quarter started. Young, the pass to Johnson. And it's Chicago with a board. 133 left in the fourth. Dosumu, the pass to MP. To the left wing. Vucevic finds MP. Back to Vucevic. MP is doubled. Low block shot. And Chicago again with a bucket. It's safe to say they have dominated this game. The game wasn't even as close as the score says in a great win for the Bulls. And you don't usually see this kind of blowout. But tonight, they delivered the punishment. I mean, what's so impressive is they never wavered in their approach. They just kept at it and showed they were without a doubt the better team. And you look at their record after tonight, 30 wins on the year. It's just a great matchup for them. And they're looking for the four game season sweep in their next meeting. And even the opposing fans can't deny this was a sensational game for MP. And you can't put a price on the value of his rebounding in this game. His effort on the glass was a game changer. And the MP is one of those guys you just love watching because he plays with such confidence, hunger, and a smile. Smith, he's checked in for Chicago. Terry comes in for Craig. Here's a Kongwu. Oh, the dunk by a Kongwu. How about the bounce? <laughs> we can call that bounce per ounce. Can't be denied. Carter on the wing. Stolen by Young. Eight-second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Pass to Bogdanovich. That one's good, and it's Young with the assist. 
It's nice they found their rhythm here, but the clock is just not their friend. It's a shame, really. If they had been playing like this last quarter, they might be in a different situation right now. MP inside, guarded by Okongwu. MP, that one's good. Stepping up and nailing an important shot to put this away. And that score probably slams the door for any would-be comebacks. And look, they put this one to bed. So it's the Bulls winning this one easily. This one wasn't even close. The hometown crowd was waiting for a miracle that never came. Yeah, and this team was consistent throughout. They met every challenge, and they earned this. Great win tonight, MP. Man, that bitch. Wins, pay the bills, baby.